Today we're going to look at SpongeBob and how we could actually melt underwater. To get this effect, we're going to wet the SpongeBob and we're going to pour sulfuric acid over him. It's very important that you wet the sponge if you want to have a quick effect. It will work without wetting the sponge, but it'll be much, much slower. All right, let's check it out. So depending what type of sponge you use, you'll get a different reaction. This is because the sponge is made out of a polymer. And whenever you're adding the sulfuric acid to the water, it generates so much heat that it kind of melts this material. So depending on the type of material you get, the melting point and uh, the chain reaction that you get, you'll get a different effect. Yeah. 